myself chef talib now i'm going to make a main course dish these are the ingredients which i'm going to use now i'm going to cut uh, fish first of all i'm going to uh, wipe some uh, water and i'm using raw fish in this uh, dish as you can see it cuts in a very beautiful shape and now i'm going to use this now i'm going to marinate the fish first i use salt salt as per taste after that i'm going to use red chili powder after that i'm going to use turmeric I'm going to use this is the mixture of zeera and some garam masala and chaat masala now i am going to add some ginger garlic paste and after that i am going to add some oil it's vegetable oil As you can see, our fish is marinated. Now I am going to refrigerate it for some. As you can see, I have some coriander leaf and mint leaf, as well as some spinach. Now I am going to make a fine paste of these ingredients. First, I roughly cut. Before cutting, I washed all these ingredients thoroughly. As you can see, our mint chutney is ready. Now, I am going to make some chaat, in which I boil some chickpeas and add some corns, which I am going to fry. As you can see, I take a pan and now I am going to on my induction. I put some oil. Now I am going to add the Stir fry those. I'm going to fry these until it gets crispy. They they are going to taste. Now it's done, and now I'm going to finely chop onion and tomato for chaat. I have mashed some chickpeas also for better shape. These are some corns, as you can see. Now, now I am going to cut a line and squeeze on it. Now I am going to add some spices, chili flakes. Take a quarter of butter. Next one, vegetable oil. Now I'm going to sprinkle some ajwain on it. Oregano. some rosemary and some lemon
you can see, it's in a proper shape. Now, I'm going to put this. Finally, my dish is ready and I named it Fish Tawa. I complement with chickpea chaat. And thank you so much and I hope you like it.